Mm, I don't know if we should be showing you this really. It's not often that we have a product in our hands that hasn't actually been released yet. Now, by the time you see this video, it would have been. No peeking from up there. But this is the latest release from Deeper. Now, this is a range extender kit for the bait boats. And if you're a bait boat user and you're a Deeper user, this is probably going to answer a lot of prayers for you. Now, it basically extends the range of your Deeper. Couldn't be simpler, but it's a very handy bit of kit. So, I haven't really seen much of it myself. Literally taken it out to charge it and put it back in the box. So, this is going to be a first look for me as well as you. So, what do you actually get in the box? Now, you've got the range extender itself, which is uh, made from pretty tough plastic. Now, like I say, this is a bit that like I've already taken out and charged, and uh, you've literally got a little magnetic plug on the back, and it just clips into place and uh, charges pretty quickly. So we'll come on to all the details and the tech spec in a little bit, but this is just what you get in the box. So you've got that. You've got a phone holder, which as you guys know, if you use Deepers regularly, that's massively important because everything is through your phone. So none of this faffing about trying to balance it on things. It actually comes with a dedicated holder. You've got the bait boat attachment itself. So this is where your deep is going to sit. And then on this end, it's actually got a little, uh, it's almost like a heavy duty sort of Velcro attachment. So that's how it will attach to your bait boat. Deep will sit in here and just screw into place. So you've got no chance of losing it. So that is the main attachment. Another little bit to pull out here, little secret compartment where you've got a neoprene case. So obviously this is going to keep it nice and protected. So when you're storing it away, you can slide that in there and then you've got a nice case to protect it. Even though, like I say, it's a hard plastic anyway, but it just keeps it that bit more protected. You've got your charging cable. So like I say, it's that little magnetic attachment. And then you've got a little box of uh, spares, I guess. So you've got a security strap, which obviously you don't want to be losing your deeper, not that you're going to, but this is an extra bit of peace of mind. Again, I'll show you how this all goes together in a minute. What else have you got? Uh, you've got a little screw, which is what's going to screw your deeper actually into the attachment. You've got the other side of the Velcro material. I will find out exactly what this is. Uh, which is going to attach to your bait boat. And then you've got a little alcohol wipe so you can clean off your bait boat before sticking that piece on. So I tell a lie, I did do one more thing before uh, actually coming out today. And I did stick one of these onto the bait boat because you need about 24 hours to let it really stick firmly. So I done that yesterday. So it's all ready to be demonstrated today. So that is what you get in the box. Obviously you get your instructions and bits as well. You've got quick guides and all your safety information. But, um, let's get into it. I'll show you exactly how to set it up and how it works. Now, before we actually jump into the setup of this product and how to actually use it, you probably want to know the five main things that you need to know. Firstly, is how much does it actually extend your range to? Now, depending on what model of DP you've actually got, it can extend your range to 200 meters. So if you're fishing big lakes in the UK, big lakes in France, being able to use your deeper at 200 meters could be a massive edge. Now, battery life is a big thing as well. It actually lasts up to 14 hours, which is a really long time. Plus, it only takes three hours to charge it to, to 100%. So if you are caught short whilst you're on the bank, you can charge it nice and quickly from any power pack as well, because it's just USB chargeable. Now, it's also really lightweight, so it's not going to add much weight to your kit. It's only 90 grams in total. Plus, it's made from a really hard-wearing ABS plastic. So, that's the five things you need to know. Let's jump into the setup and how to use it. Now, when it comes to actually setting up this product, it's easiest and simplest to break it down into a few stages. Now, you've got the range extender itself, which is going to be the first stage. You've then got the bait boat side of things, and then you've got connectivity, so connecting it to your phone and making sure everything works together. So, let's start with the range extender. Now, Deeper have actually brought out their own tripod. Now this is an additional extra, but it is very beneficial because the way the range extender works, it has to be at least 1.2 meters off the ground, which conveniently, the maximum height of this tripod is 1 meter 36. So it's ideal, like I say, it's been made for the range extender and it's actually a pretty sturdy tripod. So you could even use it for a camera if you wanted to once you've 
actually mapped out all your swim and done what you needed to with the deeper so it's not just a, a one trick pony you can use it for more than more than just that so let's get this out now i'm not going to extend it fully whilst i'm sitting here but when we move over to the lake then that's when i'll make sure it's above the one meter 20. so you get a nice carry bag with it let's get that box out of the way So it's nice and simple to set up as you expect from a tripod. Legs all go back on themselves and then hold in place. Like I say, when we do come to extend it, you've literally got three clips which will extend the legs completely. And then in the middle, you've got a little bit that screws and unscrews like that. And you've also got a bit there. God, it keeps going. So like I say, you want it at the maximum extension. And on top, you've got a little ball head so you can angle everything perfectly. Now this is where the phone holder comes in. Basically you want to screw the phone holder onto the tripod and then I'll just move that down so it's a little bit easier here. So obviously the phone's going to be facing you when you're on the bank so you want the holder this way and then the range extender simply screws into place on top now you don't have to screw this all the way down because it's more important that the rear of the range extender is actually facing the lake. So if I screw that back a little bit, then that is facing the lake perfectly. And then on the underside, you've got a little orange screw, which you can screw back against itself. So that keeps everything nice and in place once it's screwed up tight. And like I say, you need, you need the range extender vertical and the back needs to be facing the lake to give you the best possible range. Now that is that bit set up. Like I say, you've got a phone holder, so you can simply slide your phone into place there. And then that's that side of things ready to go. So if we move over to the bait boat, I'll just get this out of the way. Again, things are nice and simple. Now, like I say, yesterday before coming out, or preparing for today, I did actually put the little Velcro attachment on the back because you need to put that on about 24 hours in advance and then that just makes sure it really does stick to it nice and firmly. Now, you wanna get your deeper and the actual attachment itself. Now this will sit in perfectly into here. There's a little, uh, little bit of plastic which will fit into the bottom screw and then the middle screw Simply screws your deeper into place. So that is now nice and firmly in there. And then that is your attachment all set up. Now, like I say, you've got the Velcro and then that will simply attach onto there. And then that's really tightly on there. Now for an extra bit of peace of mind, like I say, they have provided a security strap. So if you do get bad weather and it's a bit rocky out there, then like I say, for peace of mind, you can do this. And you might notice that I've left the additional uh, screw on the top of this for this reason. So you can put the security strap, just feed it through. So you put that through back on itself. And then that's that side nice and firmly in there. Now every bait boat is going to be a bit different to how you'd attach this bit, but you can just tie it on tightly onto the handle on this one. Let's give it a double overhand knot. That's that on there. And then that will clip in place. So that is everything ready to go. So we now move on to the last stage, which is going to be syncing everything into the phone. OK, so that is everything set up other than connecting everything together. So first things first, you want to turn on the range extender. Now, there's actually three LEDs on this. So the top one that's flashing now says sonar so obviously where it's flashing that means it's not connected to anything second one down is phone again flashing not connected to anything and then the third one down is your battery indication so depending on how your battery is it will either flash one two three or four times four times obviously being full battery and you can double check this just by pressing it so it's flashed four times so i've got full battery now i'm not going to go into how to actually use a deeper how to read it things like that but I will just say the first thing you need to do to actually turn a deeper on is put it in the water. So I'm going to just drop this bait boat in the edge here.
making sure the deep is at a good angle. I should have probably chosen a better bit of bank than this. So in the holder, you want to make sure that your deeper is completely flat. So I'll overlay a little clip just to show you what I mean by that. And then now you'll see that the sonar has gone to a solid green LED. So that means that that's connected. So the next part is to connect my phone to it. So now it's showing the extender and deeper pro plus two. So the one you want to connect to is the extender because the extender is already connected to the deeper. So that's connecting now through Wi-Fi. So then once you've done that, you'll see obviously the phone goes to a solid green as well. And that means that the phone is connected to the deeper. Everything is connected together. And then you can open up the deeper app. that will show that it's connecting. You have a few different options, whether you're fishing from shore or boat, or there's actually now a bait boat option. So I've selected that just at the top here. You can select what option. Obviously, like I say, I've selected the bait boat and then it starts running. So if I drive the bait boat away, you see it's saying 0 0.7, 0 0.8 meters. And then you can start your scanning and look for a spot. Obviously it's showing all the different, uh, the, the bottom, how it's up, down, up, down. Uh, and then that's, that's it. That's pretty much everything set up. And like I say, it, you can now do this depending on your deeper up to 200 meters. So that, like I say, is a real edge. If you're fishing big lakes where you need, need the range, then it really does benefit you. And obviously it shows you all the normal, all the normal bits that the deep would show. It shows you water temperature and uh, you actually see, I'll do a close up just to show you, but there's a tiny little uh, pulsing green circle. And that means that the extender is working exactly how it should. So out of interest, I'm going to drive this all the way down the lake and just see how far I can get. Interest for me, maybe not so much for you. So I might speed this bit up. Now I'm actually going to turn that around because I'm starting to lose sight of the bait boat. But that is testament to how this range extender works because like I said, I'm losing sight of it, but the range extender is still showing perfect signal. It's still showing all the contours of the lake, all the details that you need to know, even at that sort of range. So I guess I'd put that about 120 yards. Uh, like I say, I'm gonna bring it back because I can't see it, but it is working absolutely flawlessly. I'll be honest, I'm normally put off by techie products in fishing because they're normally a bit of a faff to get set up half the time they don't work. But with this, uh, this range extender and with the, the newest deeper pro, it actually is quite a faultless system. So if everything worked like this, then my job would be a lot easier, <laughs> but unfortunately it doesn't. So yeah, top marks deeper. Like I say, if you're looking for a way that you can really extend the range of your fishing with a bait boat and know that you are exactly where you want to be, I mean, that's a really interesting little bit there, then, uh, then this is definitely a bit of kit for you. Now, you can find obviously loads more information about these, these products on the Deeper website. So it's taken ages to bring this bait boat back. But um, for now, thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. Hopefully it's been useful to you guys. And uh, if you have got any questions, obviously make sure you put something in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe to us and uh, that way you won't miss any videos like this that are coming up in the future. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.